Smoked fish is extremely popular in Côte d'Ivoire, not just as a source of nutrition and income in many African coastal communities, but in terms of food security. But the traditional smoking method has come under scrutiny for its health consequences. Over 60% of women who smoke fish have some type of smoke-related illness. We found that the women had pulmonary ventilation problems, including problems with restrictions and obstruction of their respiratory systems. We also found that they had ophthalmological problems linked to the amount of heat and smoke they receive in the eyes. Majority of these women have no other means of earning an income. In 2014, the FAO partnered with the government to introduce cleaner ovens that produce far less smoke. The ovens also reduce wood consumption dramatically. For each kilo of smoked fish produced, wood use went down from 5 kgs to just 0.8. It was very hard using the old ovens because there was a lot of smoke that makes you sick. But with these new ovens, once you put your fish in, you can actually do other things until your fish is cooked, and then you can go sell it in the market. The new oven allows them to cook larger quantities of better quality fish at a reduced cooking time, also decreasing post-harvest losses. To sustain an income during low fishing seasons, some have even began expanding their product range, creating a number of fish-based products such as croquettes, pâté and even crackers. Now that we've put in place a management system that truly meets sanitary standards, there is no reason that these fish products cannot be sold out of Côte d'Ivoire. We have now organized more women who are benefiting from this, and because of the scale of our activities, the project is now contributing to job creation and food security at a national level. The distribution of these ovens started in just four pilot communities. The plans are now underway to expand it further. Uchiyo Koronkwa, CGTN.